Hey guys, welcome back to Let's Play Blitz League 2. In the last part, I don't even know who we played. I'm just going to say this now. This is my fourth time attempting this game, and I'm pretty annoyed with it. So, let's just watch this Captain video, alright? Alright. Next up, we got the Denver Grizzlies. This guy, Tyler Neal, is electric. He's an undrafted walk-on no one had ever heard of. Well, they all know him now. Neal's one of the fastest runners in the league. Neal plays hard off the field, too. He's making the most of his newfound fame. <laughs> Hell, he's earned it. Okay, so like I said, this is my fourth time attempting this game. And when I say that, I don't mean that I've been losing. I don't know. I haven't been losing. I have been destroying them. I'm pretty sure I won by 50 last game if I had finished. Here's the problem. Um, there is, you know, there's always like, there's the little franchise things you have to do. Uh, to like get something like you know sometimes it's like when sponsor Ugh, sorry sponsors or whatever nah well this game or this yeah this particular game you have to injure the enemy team's captain uh which is fine you know it doesn't sound too difficult but i can't fucking do it <laughs> and it takes it's so goddamn hard they never like they either never give him the ball like, I, the first two times I did it, or the third time I did it, which I just did, like, a, like right before this, where I was winning by 50, I hit him five times in the game, three times with Unleashed. The dude just would not get hurt. And look at this. See, I can do this. I can injure this motherfucker, but it doesn't matter <laughs> if I injure this dude. I can rupture this dude's spleen. But that doesn't matter. All, all that matters is I injure the other guy. But of course, I can't fucking do that. Because every time they give him the ball, I either get blocked or I hit him and he just doesn't get injured. Every time. So this is the one game you'll ever see me not going for the sack every single play. Like I said, sorry if I seem pretty annoyed with this, but I am pretty annoyed because I just, like, th this game, like, I mean, I like this game and I had a lot of fun with it up until this point. And I would be having fun with it if I could just beat this part and move on. Like, if I would have beaten this part earlier on, like, the first time I tried it, I would be three games ahead by now. It's almost, uh, see, if I learned anything from my last game, I'm going to assume it's better to not have your Unleashed on defense, because Unleashed will usually cause fumbles, not injuries. Sure, they'll get, like, crap knocked out of them, and it'll hurt them, and they'll, like, not hurt them, but, like, aw. But, yeah, sure, they'll get the crap knocked out of them, and, um, like, their stamina will go down, but I don't think you actually hurt them. So... I'm going to just try to hit him with regular clashes instead of unleashed. Because I just, which, it's just so annoying. Like this game, it's like it knows, oh, you want to injure this guy? <laughs> nah. <laughs> you injure? Injure him? No, boy, that's the captain. Throw it to him, please. Like I said, I'm just going to do any chance I can, I'm going to hit him. That's all I'm worried about. No other person on the team I am worried about. See, that's the shit that happens as I end up getting fucking blocked. Whew. Oh, fuck yes! YES! Oh my god! YES! Fuck you, Tyler Neal! Fuck you! Holy shit! 
you guys don't even know. <laughs> oh my god, I don't have to worry about... Oh my god, this is... I'm sorry, like, you guys probably think I'm overreacting as shit right now. But that was so annoying. That was the fourth time I've tried playing this game. Fourth time. Finally. I finally fucking did it. Holy shit. My heart was just racing there. As soon as I saw that shit show up, I was like, fuck yes. Oh. Now I don't have to worry about shit. All I gotta do is win this game, which shouldn't be hard. Well, thank you guys for dealing with me freaking out like a motherfucker. Oh! The spin move, not even with the spin. The spin move. The spin move. Oh, come on. I was about to dive, too. It's all good. I actually, I want a passing, I want another passing touchdown. I could use some more of those. Uh, I'm going to throw it to... That down. No! <laughs> no! We're not... Okay, well, like I said, I'm not worried about winning this game at all, honestly. It's just like, ah, uh, you don't even know how long I've been trying to beat this fucking game. Like, it sounds so simple, injure that guy, and you guys are going to see this one game where I injured him in the first quarter, or second maybe, I don't even know. I think it was first still. You guys are going to look at that like, wow, he's overreacting as shit. But no. So much time and effort was gone into that game that you guys won't see of me bitching and screaming at my TV. Not really screaming. But being very angry. The fact that I was able to do it that quickly is kind of just hilarious. Let's see it. Whoops. Actually calling punt return in a game. Huh? You can't fair catch. <laughs> we I'm just having fun at this point. Who gives a fuck about life? First down and 30. Ball at the 17 Let's uh matriculate the ball down the field. Oh no, I didn't mean to call this play. Damn it. I don't want to score. <laughs> I don't want him to get the pass. And, like, I need more stuff for my guy. As soon as I picked that play, I was like, no, I didn't mean to pick that one. Whoa, that guy just went airborne. Like I said, now that I don't have to worry about Tyler Neely, you don't even understand how happy that makes me. Oh, I tried to do some cool shit and it just backfired. Oh, do dove at the wrong dude, motherfucker. can go back to my old strategy of blitzing every play. Yay. And the ball gets there too late. Or should I say the defender got there early. Yeah. It was so funny what last game. Every time they would pass it, I got a solid four interceptions last game. And, like, I would be like, no, I don't want interceptions. I want them to have the ball. <laughs> like, there was a time last game when I tried, like, when I was playing this team, I legit ran away from interception just because I wanted them to have the ball. Oh! 
<laughs> I barely made that. I don't even know if I tech like I didn't actually dive. I just like slid in. I mean, no, like I dove, but I mean, like my dive didn't actually make it. Like this little slide after my di dive, after I hit the ground, is where I made it. Yay. And they don't have their captain either, so I'm not even worried. I don't even know who I'm going to play next game, because I've been so, like, into this one. Oh, okay. Uh, could somebody tell the punter his shoes don't match? That's kind of embarrassing. <laughs> First and 30. Ball at the 40-yard mark. Oh, shit. Damn, that was a hit. I don't see any. The offense looking at first and 30. Actually, calling pass plays is kind of interesting. Instead of Hail Mary. On the play. Run back. Let me see how many. It's two. How many rushing? Because I have three. Okay, so I have three. I, I just want to make sure not every single pass is to him this season. Because I want to win the MVP. Because he won it last season. And it's like, I mean, that's fine. I mean, don't get me wrong. Like, I had a great season. But, like, it's just more interesting if I win the MVP. Like, you know, I gotta, gotta do what I can for myself. What the fuck? When you dive completely the wrong fucking way. Like I was pressing the correct direction. And he just goes not even close. You know, now that I'm playing... Okay, so essentially, like, I changed my room up a bit. And I'm playing on a new, like, screen. Like a much bigger TV. And a much better angle and shit. So I'm just, like, surprised at how nice everything looks. Like, when they it get injured and shit. Because I have, like, what I've been looking at really hasn't been the best, like, screen. So I'm just like, wow. The whole injuries. Ugh. Nasty. Nasty stuff. Bitch, you ain't getting around franchise. We reach the end of the third quarter. St. Louis. You thought, but you thought wrong. Hey, look, it's the tight end I've, like, never once thrown it to. Man, I should still be down there playing this game. I really let myself go. What happened to me? <laughs> I should be down there still playing. Oh, 
No. Oh shit. Nice. Hmm. So like does he get the receiving yards for that? Or what is that? Is that a rushing touchdown? What the fuck does that show up as? No, cause I don't even know. Who cares? Cause it's so it's like it looks like it gave me the yards but not the touchdown for it. I don't really even know. Like my aunt K used to joke, watch out for the golf bat what watch out for the puddle watch out for the golf I wasn't even paying attention there, I was listening to what the guy was saying. Can you switch to the right guy? Now their backup's injured. So now their third string running backs in. Second down and about a mile. Come on, you gotta do better than that. Oh, I almost picked that. I don't even know how many picks that would have been. It would have been at least three, right? I know for a fact I've gotten two. I'm just injuring their team left and right now. You think? Well, you think wrong. It's just a stinger. And that reminds me, I have a friend uh, who I played football with in uh, high school, and I remember he he always talked about it. Like, he was a year younger than me, so... I, damn. Okay, he was always a year younger than me, so I didn't really actually get to see this, but... So, he was a lineman, and I remember people telling me the story of, basically, he got injured in a game, he, like, hurt his arm, and he went to the sideline, and they were basically telling him, oh, no, it's just a stinger, you're fine, you'll, you'll get back in the game. And it turns out he had a broken fucking arm. And he played the rest of the game, and then he went to the doctor and realized it was broken. So that was always funny. It just reminds me of what happened to me, too. Ah. What? No. Okay, so what happened to me is when I broke my jaw. I had my I broke my jaw in high school and had to get my mouth wired shut for six weeks. Um, and so here's what happened to me. So I break my jaw, and I tell them, like, there is something wrong. I don't know what it is, but there's something wrong. And they're like, all right, well, you look fine. Go back in. Okay. And I go back in for a play. And then I take the snap. And then I realize something else was wrong. I realized my hand was fucked up. I didn't even realize my hand was fucked up until I caught my first snap when I go back in. Like, nah, there is something really wrong now. Essentially, what happened is I got so fucked up from getting tackled. I broke my jaw. I had to get my mouth wired shut for six weeks. And I also, at the same time, broke my hand in two places. So I essentially broke four bones in a single hit. Two two bones in my jaw, each side on the joint, and then my hand in two places. I just got fucked up. I don't know who this dude was that hit me, but goddamn, he fucked me up. <laughs> and, you know, it was a fun time. It's a good memory. I don't even... Re like, looking back at me breaking my jaw, I don't even... Re I hardly remember it. Even though it wasn't, it was only three years ago now? Two, four years. Wait, I'm a. It was a junior year of high school. I don't know, three or four years ago. However long, I think it was three years. It wasn't that bad. I mean, you know, people always like, oh, you couldn't eat for six weeks? That must have been awful. I mean, yeah, it was, but I mean, I had a lot of milkshakes. It really, like, the whole. I got to eat. It just wasn't the best food. And. I got used to it after a while. I mean, you know, shit happens. Hey, hey, they don't get to score. Goose egg, motherfuckers.
Alright, this is probably going to be a cutscene after this, so I'll go ahead and be quiet. Wow, he really came through for me. My stupid agent is freaking out about his new client getting hurt. He freaked out even more when I fired his ass. How about I come over tonight and show you my gratitude? Want some breakfast? Mmm, that's not what I'm hungry for. I've got two words for you, franchise. Fuck you. Have fun with your rich little model. Just don't come crying to me when she dumps your ass after she gets bored of your shit. Ha, uh, somebody's... Somebody's salty. Somebody's salty. Ooh. Oh, it's my kicker again. I mean, he... Let's see, who's somebody who's training and tackling? him in tap <laughs> so he can stop bitching about shit all right well that's gonna be it for this episode of let's play blitz league 2 i had a lot of fun playing the same game four times but you know i'm glad to finally be done with it and i'll see you guys next time when we play the arizona outlaws bye bye guys